At the end of this story, there are a few pages I'm going to show you. Again, if you'd like to view them and read them yourself, just pause the video. Back in the garden, home sweet home. The flower friends spread out through the garden. They gathered soft moss and crunchy leaves for Robin's nest. It felt good to share all that gar the garden offered. I'm a very fast worker when it comes to building my nest, Robin said. But this is the kindest thing anyone has ever done for me. Thank you for your help, flower friends. Cheery up, cheerio. We can hardly wait for your baby Robins to become part of our garden family. Maybe we can find worms for them to eat, Simi said. Until then, we have lots of other garden friends to help, said Tula. We've learned how important it is to care for other living creatures. Now, let's be sure to take good care of ourselves. That way, we'll be ready to care for others. Let's promise to keep our daisy flower garden strong and healthy for all its critters. <laughs> let's promise to make sure there are plenty of leaves and branches for the birds and squirrels to build nests with. And lots of crunchy seeds for them to eat, said Simi. Let's promise to keep fresh water in our birdbath and pond. Then our critters can drink, bathe, and enjoy splashing about, said Gloria. Let's promise to do our part to care for animals here at home and far, far away, too. We've learned so much from everyone's stories, said Mary. It's important that we share our stories. The more we teach others, the more others can care for animals, too. I'm so proud of you all, said Tula. Your stories show your strength and courage and how caring you are. We can be sisters to all animals, said Vi. I'm amazed at how much we learn from one another, said Mary. It makes me want to learn even more, agreed Gloria. I never expected to feel so proud of what I can do. It was one of my the best surprises ever, said Zinni. I felt very important to care for animals, said Vi, even if I was a little nervous at first. We all have lots of feelings inside us, said Tula. It feels good to share our feelings. It's important that we try to understand how others feel too. I'm proud that you trusted us enough to share your feelings. Vi smiled. She looked around the daisy flower garden. Birds chirped, bees buzzed, chipmunks chattered. Just then the flower friends heard a familiar meow. It's the cat, said Vi. She's back. And she brought her kittens, said Gloria. They're so tiny and sweet. I can't wait to pet them, said Zinni. Let's go, said Tula. This new cat family could use some special care, and we know just what to do. This is going to be fun, said Mary, and this is going to be another wonderful story for us to tell, said Tula. Cheerio, cheerio, said Robin the Red Robin. She couldn't have agreed more.